Hello, you beautiful, beautiful people. Today we are kicking off a series three in Forza Horizon 5 by completing this week's Forza Fun Challenges No Expense Spared. We're grabbing 160 Forza points and five points towards our festival playlist. So if you are anyone here, definitely consider subscribing. We're trying to reach 20,000 subscribers. A like rating would be much appreciated. Let's jump into this week's Forza Fun Challenges. Now to cut a long story short, OBS didn't record me completing chapters 1 and 2, so I've had to re-record it with my other account, that's why my name and my credits seem slightly skewed with. I am back on the Skippy4631 account though for chapters 3 and 4. Now for this week's Forza Thon challenges, we are jumping in the beautiful 2010 Lexus LFA. I'm pushing out 715 horsepower and four wheel drive. This car is available from the auto show at 500,000 credits. You can find it in the auction house, but the prices are pretty much the same, or you can pick it up for free from the accolades for completing the speed trap accolade supersonic. If you'd like to use my tune, just search my gamertag Skippy4631 or use the share code 421-264-584. All share codes are in the description and in the comments below. Now we will be jumping in and checking out the Forza Shop and this week's Festival Players Rewards at the end of the video, so make sure you stick around for that. But first, we're going to jump in and complete this week's Forza Challenges No Expense Spared. Chapter 1, 1 of 500. Own and drive the 2010 Lexus LFA, the apex of the LF series. The Lexus LFA is undoubtedly one of the better sounding cars in Forza Horizon 5, but own and drive, or hop outside your player house or festival site, drive two seconds down the road, and one of 500 completed. So with chapter one, one of 500 completed, it's on to chapter two, best speedometer ever. Marvel at the work of art that is the 2010 Lexus LFA Speedo as you race to a speed of 200 miles an hour. Now one of the best places to reach 200 miles an hour in the Lexus LFA is the motorway. Take a run up from here and just cruise all the way to 200 miles an hour. Here we go then, 200 miles an hour in our Lexus LFA. Let's get it, but already at 150, 160, 170. Throwing it into sick gear up to 180. Let's go, LFA on the downhill run. That's 200. Hey, best speedometer ever now. completed. So, with chapter two, best speedometer ever completed, it's on to chapter three. Apex is in the name. Live up to the Apex name by winning two road circuit events in the 2010 Lexus LFA. It's what it's made for. Now for this chapter, head on into your map and filter by the road racing events. This makes them a little bit easier to see and find. Now we need a road circuit event, so I'm going to be using a Stardo circuit. Where I have created a blueprint race called Quick Forzathon Chapter 3. One lap in length and locked to average driver tires and the Lexus LFA. Share code 498-475-485. Here we go then, race number one. Let's go for the win. Just one lap. That's all we need to get this done. Coming up to the end of race number one, across the line, first place. And after running the exact same blueprint again, we come to the end of race number two, across the line, first place. And there it is, Apex is in the name, completed. So with chapter three, Apex is in the name, completed. It's on to our fourth and final chapter this week, Ring Wraith. Famously developed at the Nürburgring, your 2010 Lexus LFA is a brilliant point-to-point -point car, so take it on a 20-mile drive. Now this chapter can be completed absolutely anywhere within the freeway map as long as you cover 20 miles. You can even do it during races to earn credits and implements along the way, but the quickest way to get it done is just to hoon it up and down the motorway. While I complete my 20 miles for this chapter, I want to give a huge shout out to all of the beautiful channel members. James, Victor, BP Gaming, El Coyote, Ken, Assumed, Kevin, Marcel, Brandy, Pike Place, Bill, Smeet, Peter, Justin, Hardy, Rod, FH4Player, Zeta, Pearl Jam, Peter, Dragon, Terry, Stephen, Easy and Owen. Thank you all so much for going that extra mile to support the channel. And after cruising for 20 miles in the Lexus LFA, that is Chapter 4, Ring Wraith completed, which finishes off this week's 
force on challenges, no expense spared. 160 of force on points in the bank and five points towards our summer wet season. So with the weekly challenges completed, let's head on into the force on shop and check out this week's goodies. So the first cut for grabs in this week's Force on Shop, the 2019 McLaren Speedtail, 700 Force on Points, can be picked up in the Auto Show for 2,250,000 credits, or you can win this car from Wheel Spins. The second cut for grabs this week, the Alumicraft Class 10 Race Car, 400 Force on Points. This isn't my kind of vehicle, but it can be picked up in the Auto Show for 300,000 credits, and just like the McLaren Speedtail, can also be won from Wheel Spins. We've also got the Star 27 face mask, pretty cool, pretty unique. And we've got the jump on it emote as well, 75 force some points for each of these. For 80 force some points, you can grab yourself one normal wheel spin. And for 300 force some points, you can grab yourself one super wheel spin. It's not the worst of force on shop this week, but it's not the best. The Illumicraft Class 10, I would probably leave that personally, not my kind of vehicle, but the McLaren Speedtail, definitely worth the 700 force some points, a very very cool car indeed. This week's rewards end for the summer wet season. For 25 points, we have the Ferrari 488 GTB. And for 45 points, new to Forza Horizon 5, the Toyota Celica 2003. For this week's online trial, winner winner, you're going to be grabbing the Jaguar E Type. For this week's Event Lab Challenge, Stunters of Paradise, you've got one normal wheel spin up for grabs. For the seasonal playground games, Soaked, you've got the Forza Link chat phrase, I'm the best at games. Three PR stunts, we've got two normal wheel spins and one super wheel spin up for grabs. For the seasonal championships, Come Rain or Shine, the number 25 Ford Bronco up for grabs. We've got the Maserati GTS for completing Grand Gesture. And for the Mini Adventure, we've got the Mini JCW Buggy. Now for this week's photo challenge, Herding Cats, it says a Forza Link reward cat meow, but I'm pretty sure this is a car horn. Onto the Horizon Open and the Eliminator challenges, we've got the Mexican Traffic Light car horn, and we've got the clothing reward of the Spake Sundress. And then for the collectibles, Lights Out, we've got Smash 25 solar panels, 25,000 credits up for grabs. That's it, this week's Forza Fun Challenges, no expense spared, completed. If you have any questions about the weekly Forza Fun Challenges or the festival players, do hit me up in the comments. I'll do my best to help you out. But as always, thank you so much for watching. Like I say, definitely consider subscribing for more videos just like this one here on the channel. A like rating would be much appreciated. Stay safe and have an awesome day.